Simplifying my fall wardrobe is exactly what I needed to move quickly throughout my week. Hey beauties, this is Janine Z and welcome to Chic Confidence where you grow in style and grow in confidence. Today's video is going to be about what I wore this week. I hope this video serves as great inspiration for you. These outfits will be easy. They are using a lot of things that I use in my capsule wardrobe. So if you have seen any of my capsule wardrobe videos before, this is just gonna show you how I'm putting those pieces together and creating the looks for the week. I hope you enjoyed it. This video will have five different looks in it. If you're wondering, am I wearing these heels? Yes, I do. Or am I wearing these coats? Yes, I do. I live in Florida, Florida close to Georgia. So it is cold in the morning, cold in the evening, and really hot during the day. So a lot of these outfits, I am taking off my outerwear in the middle of the day, but I have it available for me in the top and bottom part of the day. So that's one thing I want you guys to keep in mind. Do I wear heels? Yes. I also am that type of girl though, who has a pair of flip flops in her car. So anytime I need to be comfortable, I can be comfortable. And so these are the outfits. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you find these pieces very helpful. And because I am pulling pieces out of my capsule wardrobe, one of the things that I will do is I will put a replacement item for anything that is sold out. I looked up everything before this video, so everything I'm showing you is currently in stock. So everything that is sold out, there will be a replacement item, which I will show you and tell you the price of in this video. Let's get started. In outfit number one, I am using a black wool coat that I got from Mango a couple years ago. They make this coat or this kind of coat every single year. And so I'm showing you the one that is out right now. This is called the Mango Tailored Wool Coat. This coat retails for $199. As I said before, mine is a couple of years old and it is still going strong. It's one of those things I think I will have in my closet for at least 10 years. So it was a worthwhile investment. I actually paid very similar price to what's paying, what is charged now, which is great because inflation is going up. But on this item, I feel like it's actually worth its value. So it's $199 for this black wool coat. Under that, I have on a Shein turtleneck. The turtleneck is sold out, but Shein has made a new one. One that looks pretty much very close to the same is $14. So you can get this one that's very similar to what I'm wearing, a camel colored turtleneck for $14. I actually feel like the quality of this was really good. I wore it last year, that's when I bought it. I'm actually pulling it out this year, which means it's held up that long. And it's a color that I like to wear. I like turtlenecks that are in blacks, white, neutrals um camel color this is closer to a camel color and so it's one that i'm pulling out over and over again i'm wearing a blue jean now this blue jean i got from forever 21 and the ones that i saw on their website there was nothing comparable to it and so i found this one from express i actually love this color of jean this jean is very super high-waisted that's what they call it the super high-waisted mid-wash baggy wide leg jean i know it's a very long name. What I love about the jean though is really the detail on the bottom of the leg. You see that um, interesting stitching pattern, but it's still in the same color of the medium wash jean. So it's not taking away from the jean and not doing too much. I feel like you can move this in and out of your wardrobe really well because it's not a pattern that takes over and you can get a lot of use. I personally have always loved a wide leg pant and jean and I just think that when you're sewing it with this outfit where the turtleneck is really close to your body, the jean is very loose, I think it looks really good. This jean from Express is $45. On my feet are some leather sandals from Mango. Mango currently has this heel strap sandal. It's a very low heel, which is what I like about the sandal. The sandal retails for $119.99. Because it's black, there is no other detailing on it. It's no gold or silver on it. It's just a classic black sandal it can get so much use in your wardrobe this is why i like this shoe i feel like it goes with everything the heel is very low and comfortable i wore this on sunday i actually wore this to church this is our church we can wear jeans this is what i wore to church and our church is freezing cold which is why i have a coat on for church because our church is really freezing cold but i just liked it it's a very comfortable shoe to be in when i'm like meeting guests or talking to people after the service. I'm standing around. I'm not concerned about my feet. 
it's a comfortable shoe. So this is the mango sandal for $119.99. And then we have the Banana Recup Public Classic Leather Tote. I mentioned this tote before in my last video. I absolutely love the tote. My favorite part of the tote is that it can change shapes. It can have that inverted shape that you see me modeling, but it also can have a very wide typical tote shape. So it gives you room to play around, room to put things in, and I really just love the bag. It's just comfortable, easy to throw around. You don't have to worry about it, no fuss. Genuine leather, $152, love it. Now for earrings, the earrings that I had on are the same earrings that you're seeing me wear in this outfit. And it is these, these are from Belk. They are 24 karat plated earrings. I have had these earrings for two years. At the time I bought it, I think I spent $40 on them. They go in and out of sale. Right now they are on sale for $10. This is 24 karat gold over silver, I believe. When I say that I've had these earrings for two years and for 40 bucks, and I feel like it was so worth the money because they look exactly the same after two years. I bought my mom a pair when I bought mine. Hers looks exactly the same after two years. It's just wonderful. So since they are on sale for $10, I am going to urge you to click on that link and rush and pick this earring up. I think you will get so much juice out of it. I absolutely love it. And finally, I am wearing the Coach Josie watch. Now, I went ahead and picked this one up for you guys so you guys can see. I'm going to bring it close. It looks like this. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a standard gold watch. You squeeze here, and it opens like this, and then it closes back. As you can see by the size of this, I have links taken out because my wrists are really, really, really small but it was not an expensive thing. It was $15 for me to get the links taken out of this watch and I just think it's absolutely beautiful. I told you guys I wanted a gold classic watch. I love Coach anyway, so of course Coach would be one of the ones I would be thinking about, but I love it and I just think it's absolutely beautiful. This watch retails for $110, so I think it's a steal. I think it's a great price. If you price watches, you can pay more, you can pay less, I like this one, I got this one, I love this one. So the next thing I got is my leather trench coat. This is not a new coat for me, I absolutely love it. I picked it up a couple years ago from New York and Company. It's gonna be in my wardrobe probably till the day I die as long as I'm around the same size because I love it. The one that I saw when I was looking for a trench coat to recommend though was one from Anthropology. This coat is $179, which is really a good price for a full leather coat that is of this quality. I love the details of it. I love the buttons on it. As I said before, with a leather coat and like the wool coat, these are things that if you get it, they should remain in your closet for a minimum of 10 years. Like they really should. And so I just think it's a worthwhile investment, $179, love it. Now under that I have on a short sleeve turtleneck. I mentioned this in another video. The one that I think that you guys should get is this mango, mango black stand tea collar shirt. This shirt retails for $19.99. I think it's an excellent price for a rib shirt and it's from Mango and I have said before, I love Mango's quality on things. So I just really think this is a great shirt. Put that under the leather coat. And then I wanted to have a mini skirt. Now I was out with my husband, we went to Express and he bought this mini skirt for me. Thank you, hubby. I love it and I wanted to recommend it to you guys. This is the Express Faux Leather Super High Waisted Leather Mini Skirt. It retails for $68. I just think that having a leather mini skirt is a must. I've always had one, not always, but you know, I've had one for a long time in my wardrobe. I love this bit of this one. I wasn't sure about it when I like saw it on the hanger. When I put it on, I feel like the length is an appropriate length for a grown woman. That's a big thing because right now mini skirts are really tiny. I'm not going to be able to do that. I need to have a mini skirt that I feel comfortable in. And so that mini skirt, I really, really enjoyed. It's $68. It fits really well. I absolutely loved it paired with this outfit. Now let's talk about the shoes. For my birthday, I bought these shoes from Macy's. I love these shoes. They are absolutely gorgeous. Can you see the bling? They tie up 
here and I guess you could tie it however you want it but honestly it's the rhinestones it's the crystals on the shoe that makes the shoe for me this is uh, from INC this shoe is called the Sunday shoe it is $69.95 I believe yeah this shoe is $69.95 and I honestly feel like that's a sale because I really think I spent $100 on this but I absolutely love the shoe it's really gorgeous absolutely love it now, I'm the type of person who likes bags to match their shoes. And so I went on Macy's and I found this bag. This is also a bag by INC. They call it the Pleated Clutch. And the color, I think, is in silver. This bag is not exactly the same as this shoe. I want to put this up close. But it's the closest that I can find. I really don't understand why INC didn't use the exact same crystals on the bags and the shoes, but they did not. Regardless though, this is a beautiful pairing. And since your feet are on the ground and your hands are not, when you wear them together, it looks like they are together. So I absolutely love this. I just think it's just a fun little combination. In my ears are some flower silver earrings. And I went and looked, I recommended you those earrings in the last video. I guess people bought them because they totally sold out. And so I was like, okay, I wanna find something really similar to that. And I found these from Zales. This is called a puff four leaf clover earring. This earring is in sterling silver and it is $19.99. Now for me, I love the flower earring just because I feel like when I wear it, because it's something different, not standard, it just makes me happy. And so I wanted you guys to get that same feeling. This one is actually better quality than the one that I have because it is in sterling silver, but the price is still that price that's really great at $19.99. So I wanted to recommend this earring from Zales to you. And then I had on a silver watch. The watch that I have, I got from Target a couple years ago. I looked on the website, it's discontinued. And so let me recommend this one for you. This is the Kendall Plus Kylie's Women's Silver Tone Crystal Stainless Steel Watch. This watch retails for $37.50 and it's beautiful. It's just a really beautiful watch. Now, as you already know, I bought the Coach watch because I love a gold watch, but I am someone who wears both metals. And so gold and silver, they make the magic happen for me. And so I needed one of both in my arsenal and that's what I want to recommend to you guys. Now, outfit number three is actually, I think one of my favorite looks for this particular video. It might be the favorite look and it's because I love a puffer jacket. The one I'm wearing, I bought again years ago from Rue 21. Let me back up and say, as I said before, I am someone who believes in buying pieces that last and last and last and building a wardrobe out of that that is very functional. So some of my stuff is just going to be old. That's just going to be what it is. And what I'm going to share with you are things that you can get that you can hang on to so that you can rewear it. And although they are older pieces, you still have a fresh look. One that I found similar is this Old Navy short puffer jacket. Now, what I love about this particular puffer jacket is the collar. It's a very fat collar. And I honestly feel like that's why I love the one I have now. I think that collar just gives it a little bit of edge, a little bit of something different, a little bit of interest. And so the collar is the thing that I was looking for, and I found it in this one. This jacket is very affordably priced at $49.99. And so I think for 50 bucks, something that you can pick up every year and wear for like 10 years, you can't beat it with a stick. Love it. And so that's the jacket I want to recommend to you guys. Under that, I have a mango ribbed sweetheart neckline shirt. They have basically the same thing again, but they're calling it a square neckline shirt. I don't see anything square about this shirt but i absolutely love the one i have and i'm very willing to recommend this one to you this shirt retails for 29.99 so 30 bucks love it love it love it love it absolutely love it with that i have on a white leg jean that i recommended before that i got from massimo duty the one that I found that is pretty close and gives that same vibe that the Massimo Duty jean kind of gives is this jean from Weekday. This jean is retails for $84, so very similar in price to the Massimo Duty one. It's just a really great cut, and I think that really matters when you're trying to have a wide leg jean. To me, certain jeans don't give you the same vibe. I like the vibe of this jean.
Now the shoes that I have, I got from my mother-in-law and they are one in state. Um, the shoes that I have on are one in state pointed toe boots. I know th I thought that these shoes were like discontinued everywhere, but I found a few pairs on Walmart's website. So I'm going to link that below in case you want to pick it up. I love the shoe because it's a very easy shoe to walk in. It's a very like chunky heel comfortable shoe easy to, easy to maneuver easy to do life in now on the walmart website i do remember seeing that mainly the small sizes were still available if you're a size 10 don't either bother clicking on that link but if you have a smaller shoe size and you're interested the shoe is still available i have my michael kors piper pouch i love this pouch i bought the pouch because i I love the gunmetal detailing on it and I am just a person who believes that everybody needs like a crocodile bag in black. I just feel like it's a classic. Everyone should have it. And so I love this one. This bag retails for $358. And by the way, those boots that I'm wearing, they were on sale at Walmart for $22. I bought them for $100. It's a great price. I'm also wearing a silver watch. I already recommended the Kendall and Kylie watch. I will pop that one up again. The necklace that I have on was a silver one that I got from Sterling Forever. They don't make this one anymore. So I found this one. This one is from Silver Reflections. This one is an 18 inch necklace. It's silver plating over brass. So the quality should be good. It should be something that holds up. And it's an affordable price. It's $24. And so if you're looking for some kind of silver chain necklace, honey, this is it. And then I have on silver hoops for Anne Klein. They don't make those anymore. They make these ones. If you're interested in this one, which is a slightly smaller hoop, but just still carries the same vibe, check it out. This one retails for $26. And then I have a silver ring on my finger. Majori makes this ring. I think I actually want this one. It's the sterling silver wave ring. And I know I have a silver ring. It's probably just going to serve a similar purpose, but I just like it. And so... I'm thinking about purchasing this ring from a jewelry. It's the sterling silver wave ring again. I just think it's simple but interesting and I just love simple but interesting. So it's my vibe. The price of this ring is $68. It really is silver. I think it's worth the price. Outfit number four, I'm wearing a blazer. I'm wearing a leather blazer that I got from Zara. The one that I'm showing you is from Mango. I personally know everyone in the world likes Zara blazers. I prefer mangoes over it. I just do. It is what it is. I just prefer a mango blazer. This blazer is $129.99. And like most things that I've gotten from mango, it's worth every penny. I think this is just beautiful. I love the cut. It's slightly oversized, which everyone is still rocking now. So I think it's even slightly edgier than the one that I got from Zara. If I was to do it again, I would just get the one from mango but I have this one, I'm gonna wear it. I spent my coin on it. I'm recommending this one to you. And if you want to go ahead and check out the one from Zara and see if they have something like that, I'm pretty sure they do. This one is from Mango, it's $129.99. I think it's beautiful. I think the cut is beautiful. I think, I think it's a little bit edgier than mine personally, and I just like it. Under that, I'm wearing a crew neck shirt that I got from Mango. It is a fine knit shirt. I really, really love the shirt. The shirt retails for $19.99. I think this is just a basic shirt, but it does the job really well, and I will have it in my wardrobe for a while. Then I wanted to do something a little bit different, and so I put on some lilac pants. I bought these lilac pants like um, earlier this year, and I haven't worn them too much, so I was like, I need to try to incorporate them into a look. This is how I incorporated this one into the look. This pant came from Zara as well. They don't make this pant anymore, but Mango makes these ones and I actually like the Mango ones better mainly because there's a belt loop in the pant and I just find that I like pants with belt loops because you can wear a belt and I just think that you look a little bit more smart when you're wearing a pant with a belt. This pant is called the Mango Straight Leg Suiting Pant. It's an ankle length pant it's a, actually a nice, a slightly more muted purple one than the one I have, which I actually think lends to a little bit more of an elevated look. But I love how this outfit turned out. 
honestly, I didn't think I was really going to wear these pants again. And I just love that I challenged myself and I think it added a little pop. It added a little interest and it kind of gave me this cool wintry feeling, even though this is more of a dressier fall type pant. But I love the look. On my feet, I have on sock boots. The ones I'm going to show you are these sock boots from Express. This is the Express Thin Heel Sock Boot. This sock boot retails for $50. It is very reasonably priced. And I just think that because it's a sock boot, it's something that you'll get a lot of wear out of. I know you will. Again, I'm wearing the Coach Josie watch. It's the piece that I decided to wear because I'm adding a little bit of gold hardware to this look. I have on small earrings from the Lauren Conrad set. That set right now is $950. <laughs> That's funny. That set right now is $9.52. And it comes with three different styles of small hoop earrings. So it gives you a little bit of versatility while still letting you look kind of classic with a small hoop look. And then I have on my initial nameplate. Nordstrom makes the Brachia initial nameplate. That nameplate is $50. So that's the look. I really loved how everything turned out. Wait a minute. I also wore the Banana Republic tote with that outfit as well. So this tote is putting in work because I love it. And so that makes up the full outfit. Outfit number five is about the leather jacket. I'm wearing a black leather jacket. This one I picked up last year from Mango. Mango came out with the exact same jacket this year. This jacket retails for $79.99. Absolutely love the jacket. If you're looking at it and you like it too, you should check it out. I just think it's a piece that I'll have in my wardrobe. Again, like 10 years. You'll probably see this for 10 years, but I'll style it different so it'll seem fresh. But it'll be around for a while. I'm wearing it with that same mango fine knit crew knit shirt that I had on before. That was $19.99. Again, I told you it's a basic piece, so it's going to get its use it's going to put in some work in my wardrobe. And now I'm wearing it with the cream Massimo Duty pants that I showed you guys before. I'm sure that a lot of you guys bought these jeans out because they are no longer in stock anymore. So I had to look for something that I felt would be really just a good pair of jeans to have. And so I found these Ecru jeans from River Island. They retail for $84. They are more of a flared leg than a wide leg, but the color was gorgeous. And I feel like if you wanted a vibe and even to show off her shape a little bit more, this would be a really good jean to have in your wardrobe to kind of do this kind of same look with. And again, I wanted to put on silver again. So I'm showing you again that Kendall and Kylie watch because I wore a silver watch that day. I'm showing you the Ancline silver earrings because I wore again that that day. And then I wore this leopard print scarf. Now this scarf was gifted to me from a friend. So I do not even know where she got the scarf, but I've had it for a couple years now, maybe like five years, not even a couple. I've had it for several years now. And I just feel like since leopard is one of those things that do not go out of style, it's something that's not going to leave my wardrobe unless somebody else or I find an amazing leopard scarf that really just needs to replace this one. The one I found for you guys is this Balangaro scarf. This is a different type of scarf. It's a heavier, more winter, fall appropriate scarf. But the reason I chose this particular scarf, one, I think is more season appropriate for the weather we have going on right now. And two, the tones of this are neutral. One of the main reasons that I like the leopard scarf that I'm wearing is because it's not a brownie, orangey type of leopard. It's a, a very muted type of leopard. And I feel like that muted type of leopard really can go with more things in your wardrobe. So this one is the one I'm showing you guys. This scarf retails for $64 and I think it's a great price. It's a heavier scarf. Something that, again, you should have in your wardrobe like I did for like five years because it's just that good. Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. I wanted to do this because I just felt like being honest. There are things that I wear that are years old in my wardrobe that has just held up with time. And then I like put some new pieces in like the INC bag and shoes or the Piper bag or the coach go to watch. Like I add those little things in to refresh the wardrobe. Also something new in that I'm wearing now is this necklace. This is a Banana Republic necklace. Um, I just wanted a herringbone necklace. I will link this necklace below too. This is a Shein blazer. I have on, again, those belt coops. And what you're seeing on top is this white express tube top, which 
it was available in the summer. I don't know if it's available now, but if I find it, I will link that as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, I am Janine Z. Welcome to Chic Confidence, where you will really learn how to grow in style, but also grow in your confidence. You have a great day. Bye-bye.